You guys, welcome back. Autumn has casted a spell over the land, with cozy hues of red and gold slowly creeping over the hills. When I think of this season, cozy spices come to mind. Today I'll be making a moody, caramelized pork and egg stew that's full of comforting spices and aroma. It's loved and eaten by many across Asia. Let's get started. Let's start by making an herb paste, black pepper, cilantro roots about this size, and garlic. On medium heat, let's toast up the herb paste. Once it's fragrant, remove and set aside. and palm sugar. On low heat, allow the sugar to caramelize. Keep an eye on it because it can burn quickly. I'm using skinless pork belly, but any cuts of fatty pork would work. Even chicken or tofu would work. Once the palm sugar has deepened in color like this, add the pork belly in. On medium high heat, add the toasted herb paste back in. Allow the ingredients to coat the meat well. Starting to smell nice. For seasonings, these are the brands that I'm using. You may have to adjust the amounts depending on the brands that you use. For more aromatics, you can go cinnamon sticks, star anise, and Chinese five spice powder. In some water. And ginger. This is dried bean curd, which has been fried and cut into triangles. Your local Asian grocery store will carry it in the refrigerated sections. They act as a sponge, soaking up a lot of the delicious broth and are fun to eat. And hard-boiled eggs that have been shelled. Gently submerge them into the stew to prevent them from breaking. And lastly, golden mountain seasoning sauce. It can be added earlier, but I almost forgot. Smells incredible. 
Simmer on low heat at least an hour. After an hour, the stew is ready. Taste and adjust the flavors to your liking. The broth should be rich, savory, and a bit sweet. The pork is tender, and the eggs have taken on some color, which is iconic in this stew. Serve it up with a plate of jasmine rice and enjoy. This stew embodies all of the essence of autumn. Cozy, moody, and full of comforting spices and aroma. Please give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you all in the next video. Be safe everyone.